Hello friends, you're watching Analytics Solutions and today in this video I'm show you how can we install Dockers in CentOS 7. So basically we have a repository in CentOS. Uh, we, when we install fresh uh, CentOS we have a repository. We have to just enable that repository and after that we, we can just execute yum install docker and our docker will be installed. So now let's see. Now we'll go to et, uh, etc yum.repos.d now if I do ls over here, so we have that centos base dot repo. I'll just film that file. And here I'll go to the end. Here you will find a repo with the name extras. Okay. So here I'll just uncomment the base URL. And I'll just enable this repo. And then just I'll execute this command yum install docker. So here you can see we have got that package docker. And another way is we can just go to Google and we can just type download. Space docker.com download space docker.com so here we got that link so here we have uh, I'll choose Linux and here we'll choose CentOS we have similarly if we have four other uh, distributions of Linux and I'll choose 7 Uh, here you can see we do have a repository too of this uh, we can just add this repository and we can just execute yum install then and we'll choose here x86 64 and then we'll choose stable and then we'll choose packages so here you can see we have the packages of uh, this dockers too over here we have to just download the package the latest one is this one we have to just download it and we have to download this SE Linux package also for docker and then we have to just uh, install it okay and our docker will be up and running so but this method is easy and this is more preferable similarly we have that option also like uh, just adding this repo this is the docker repo we can add also uh, just duplicate this repo to our uh, this uh, this yum dot repos dot d. Okay, so here it shows the Docker has been installed. So to verify that, I'll run Docker uh, hyphen hyphen version. So Docker has been installed, but if I run some commands like uh, Docker uh, info. So it is saying cannot connect to the daemon means it is asking that uh, is the daemon running uh, means the service of uh, docker running so if i do system ctl status docker so here you can see it is loaded but is it is inactive so i'll just start the service so the service of docker has been started so I'll just enable the service. So I've uh, enabled the service. Now I'll run docker info. So here you can see we have got this output. It means docker has been installed successfully. Everything about docker is uh, listed in docker info. Like which OS we are using and everything has been given over here. So that's it guys. Uh, we have shown the complete installation of Docker. So thank you guys for watching this video. And I have given the link of Docker uh, installation of Docker Compose in the uh, description. Just uh, if you want to install Docker Compose too then you can refer that link.